find the symmetric line of your projection area. Next, install the mount directly aligned to the symmetric line. After standard mount wall mount is installed on the wall, place the laser unit triangle aligned to the symmetric line and connect the USB power cord. After the Iris 9090 is hardware installation is completed, uh, we will start uh, with the projecting area surface. Um, the surface does not have to be a matte whiteboard. Uh, any um, solid surface, uh, non-reflective matte surface will do. Um, here we use a whiteboard as an example. Um, so the first, uh, we will use the Iris driver software um, to do the auto calibration. Um, it, uh, it's a simple touch of a button and we will do the auto calibration patterns which will help the stylus to perform. Usually this step is within one minute, it does not take long. And now it's complete so the style should be working. Now the second part is the finger. If you want to use your finger to perform touch functions, you need to calibrate here. It's 25 points. Um, you only, uh, if you didn't alter your setup, you only need to do this process once. Uh, this will take a couple minutes. Usually two to three minutes. Okay, now it's done. The other part is uh, the teacher can use the screen record function to record whatever is performed on the Italian space software and also in the desktop mode. For example, uh, anything you perform actions here in the Italian space software and on the desktop. For example, opening the Word file, all these actions will be recorded regardless whether it's in the desktop mode or in the Italian space whiteboard mode. Anything will be recorded in this period. And once uh, the file has been recorded, you can use uh, provide the file to the students who are absent in class. The file size is very small. An hour of um, lecture will not take more than 100 megabytes of file size. So um, the desktop mode is what stands out among other uh, solutions on the market. For example, um, our intelligence space software has a desktop mode that can interact with Windows desktop applications such as Word, you can make some remarks. For example, and anything you want to you can take a snapshot and save it on the whiteboard. Save for future references. And if you want to open a PDF file, you can do so at your pleasure. And the PDF files can make remarks too. And it's the same with the Word files. And you can also take the snapshot as well. The Italian Space software has the desktop mode that can interact with it almost all the software that's supported on Windows and as long as the application supports hand gestures like for example the Microsoft Word it will support hand gestures as long as the application supports it so that's the uh, biggest part which stands out between the competition and IntelliSpace other functions like uh, geometry circles, triangles, rectangles, all these are available too. As long as the T 
teacher needs to also um, the lines for math class including vectors and different backgrounds for math class you can have different coordinates these are the different functions that's useful for the teachers which uh, for example in the math class you can have an origin 00, zero here and you can have a negative point A which is for example negative 4 something like that and you can have a vector 